Paul knew at six, the final living chapter of the R RMS Titanic was over. Melvina Dean, the last survivor of the Titanic, passed away Sunday. Dean had a friend right here in the Tennessee Valley, and as WHMT News 19's Jamie McGriff reports, a friendship was an opportunity of a lifetime. The Huntsville says he'll always cherish the memories of his dear friend, Melvina Dean. And this is a famous picture of her, her mother and her brother and his dog. And I don't think anyone knows the dog's name, but I have here in a letter that the dog's name was Willow. She died over the weekend at the age of 97 in England. She was the last survivor of the RMS Titanic. Because she was only uh, two months old when the Titanic went down. She was kind of the pride of Titanic. She was the youngest. They lifted her down in a potato sack. At two months old, Dean was lowered into a lifeboat as the Titanic sank on the night of April 14, 1912. The ship hit an iceberg during its maiden voyage and sank within three hours. Jones, a writer and longtime friend, says he had a fascination with the Titanic that started ten years ago. And as fate would have it, he got in touch with the British Titanic Society, who then put him in touch with Melvina Dean. I did uh, several hour-long um, phone interviews with her and, um, over the years, and she uh, invited me for tea to come to England to have tea with her, and I did that back last year. Dean lived in a nursing home in the southern English city of Southampton, the Titanic's home port. When Jones and Dean met, they became instant buddies and kept in touch through cards and letters for a decade. The correspondence over the years, these are just a few. Um, this is an audio CD that I have done. Jones says he learned a lot about Dean. I have uh, her answering questions, what her father did before they boarded the Titanic. He ran a pub and in England. He says she never knew her father, but in spite of this, Dean was a living jewel for the history books. In Huntsville, Jamie McGriff, WHT News 19. That's hilarious. He runs the audience. Dean survived the Titanic, and so did her mother and brother. Her mother died in 1975, and her brother died in 1992. When asked if there was one thing she wished she could remember, Joan says she told him that she would have liked to have remembered how cold it was that night.